Hello and welcome to the supplementary video to the Basic Navigation 2 certification. In this tutorial, we'll go through the principles of navigating to an unmarked surface point of interest, or POI, using a method we call trilateration. To use this method, first we need to understand orbital markers, or OMs. OMs are used to quantum travel around celestial bodies in Star Citizen. Each moon and planet has six of them. OM1 is over the North Pole and OM2 the South Pole. OM3, 4, and 5, and 6 are around the equator. OMs are geosynchronous and stay fixed relative to the rotation of the planetary body. In this example, we are using the following coordinates. OM2, 459.4, OM3, 204, OM5, 429. The numbers after the OMs mean the distance from the OM to the destination. Since OM3 has the shortest distance, we must use that as our point of origin. Let's jump to OM3. Now let's find the other two OMs, 2 and 5. See that if we draw a line between them and, center, and the center of the planet, you will get a triangular sector. Before you start your descent, compare the distances of the OMs and use that information to pick a place on the surface that should be somewhere close to the actual destination. Distance to OM5 is shorter than OM2, so we will just adjust our approach a bit to the right. Enjoy the scenery and remember to keep your eye on the altimeter, especially on moons and planets without atmosphere. Keep adjusting your direction to get close to the target distances. When you get close to the surface, try to keep your altitude at about 2,000 meters. Find the OM you want to approach first. Use the compass heading to fly in the direction of that OM. You may not be flying directly at it. Check the distance once in a while so you don't overshoot it. When you reach the desired distance written in your coordinates, locate the other OM and repeat the process. Now look around for all three OMs used in the trilateration. You might have to correct small errors in the distances. Do this now. The best way to find unmarked ground-based POIs is to use the third-person camera view on the ship. You will need to be within a few kilometers for it to render in. Look around until you find anything that stands out. Use your ship lights if necessary. To recap, first, you need to know the distance from at least three orbital markers to navigate to the point of interest. Start with the OM that has the shortest distance from the, to the destination as your origin point. Take into account the distances to OMs when choosing where to descend. Use the compass heading when approaching OMs. When distances to OMs match your given coordinates, use third-person camera to locate the POI. Be sure to review the rest of the guide and reach out to the initiative certifiers if you have problems or questions. 
This tutorial was brought to you by Mako Media on behalf of the Initiative Wing Academy.